Hello students, I would like to walk you through a sample Patriots pen essay that I just wrote this weekend. Let's take a look at what I put into my essay and see if it looks anything like your essay. First of all, let's go up to my introductory paragraph. And right here is my introduction. And I want you to take a moment and think about what are the three things I said should be in your introduction. If you need to, pause it for five seconds and see if you can list the three things that go in an introduction. Did you say hook? Did you have a thesis? And did you give background information? Well, let's see if I did all three of those things. First of all, do I have a hook? Winston Churchill once said that democracy is the worst form of government, except for all the others that have been tried already. So, yep, I have a hook. I used a quote. So here's my hook, and it is a quote. So I used a quote. Did you see it? Ooh, let me make sure I spell my Q there, right? Did you see how I use quotation marks around my quote? Next, I told you what's coming up in my paper. I said my background. I said what that we might have problems and everything might not be perfect, but we have great opportunities for advancement. So here's a little bit of my background, and this is what I was gonna talk about in my paper. Finally, my last sentence is my thesis statement. America's gift to my generation is a democratic government. That's my thesis statement. So did Mr. Score have all three parts of an introduction? Yes, he did. Let's come to my next two body paragraphs. I have two body paragraphs. I've just numbered them one and two. And let's see if I talk about what I said I would talk about in my background. Did I talk about greater chances for opportunity and that we have problems, everything might not be perfect. Let's see what I got. In many other countries of the world, people do not have the chance to choose their leaders or have a say in how their government is run. Where is the fairness if you get no voice in your nation's law, rules and laws? Countries such as China have one government run by one party. By having the opportunity to cast my vote to choose my leaders, I am a part of my country. My voice matters just as much as anybody else's. I have a say in the future of my nation. Ooh, actually I didn't. So let me come back up here to the beginning and I might say, oh, I didn't actually talk about that. Maybe instead I could say, we have the chance to be heard. We have the chance to be heard. Yeah, that's actually what it sounds like I was talking about. Then I'll just make this a new sentence. Democracy offers Americans a greater chance for opportunity. Let's see if I talk about that. When I have a say, I also have the chance to make sure things are fair. Democracy allows me, just like every other American, the same chances. Oh, sounds like I'm talking about this. Nobody has an unfair advantage. For example, ooh, transition phrase. I can become a doctor, lawyer, or even a politician. The choice is mine as to what I want to be. I can go as far in life or as little as I want. Now let me check out my conclusion. Actually, I'm going to look for any other transitions, um, such as, uh, for example, I see two so far. All right, let me, let me come to my last paragraph now and let me see how my conclusion sounds. My last paragraph here is my conclusion. Democracy can be messy. Nobody said it wasn't. When you have millions of people with different opinions and ideas, things can seem noisy and chaotic. So if you notice here, I'm trying, I'm trying throughout every single paragraph to bring me back to what I think America's gift is. Democracy, democracy, democratic society. So I've mentioned democracy or democratic society at least four times, plus I gave examples of it such as, for example, so your Patriots Pen essay, um, I have to work on mine just a little bit more. I'm short 15 words. I'm at 285. But 
in this paragraph, or paragraphs, sorry, I have an introduction with a hook, background, and thesis. I have two body paragraphs, and I have a conclusion. Take a look at it and just see what you think.